Uh, good morning, Nick Beek from BBC News. The prominent Vote Leave campaigner Boris Johnson is saying today that the UK will face a much bigger bill if it stays in the EU. He's talked about a triple whammy of woe, saying that the UK will face this bigger bill because of budget increases here in Brussels, future Eurozone bail bailouts. And he's also claiming that there's a £20 billion black hole in the EU finances. And as a consequence, the UK would have to pay an extra £2.4 billion if the UK were to remain in the EU. What do you make of that? Well, let me start by saying that obviously I will not wade into the uh, debate uh, that is currently ongoing in the United Kingdom. We don't do campaigning, but we do facts. So let me give you a few of those. The most important fact that you and everybody else needs to remember is that the amounts that were fixed in the multilateral financial framework 2014 to 2020 are set in stone, in concrete, if you wish. And unless all member states agree to, the, to those amounts being changed, they cannot be changed. I repeat, they cannot be changed. That should be put to rest everything that goes in that direction. On the black hole that you mentioned, that simply does not exist. Um, the, um, the, the budget that was voted in uh, 2015 for this year, for 2016, has already put in place the necessary means to reduce that backlog, to make it uh, phased out by the end of this year, which means that the money is going to the beneficiaries, it's going to the businesses, to the universities, the researchers, the farmers, uh, and all the other beneficiaries in the UK and elsewhere. Did I forget something? Yes, please. Yes, hello. Uh